Hello guys, Edfake here and I have moved to my redstone testing world. You may notice. Um, I set this up when I first got Minecraft just because I could and I just wanted to test some things. You'll see there's a giant figure right over there. That's um that's pretty cool. And um you also may notice that I could not wait for the piston mod. I really wanted to make some inventions so when it does come out I can show you in my let's play. Um, and yes, episode 10 is delayed because I've been sick, school's been in the way, and all that jazz. And um, so I'm, I'm probably not going to be doing it. It should be up next week sometime. But anyways, um, this invention, which you see right here, was uh, um, actually done by a guy called, I think it's Hans Lemerson. I don't know how to say it. So correct me if I'm wrong. It's Hans Lemerson, I think, um, and basically it's he called it the reversible signal generator. Um, anyways, so this is what it does. We, we will call this piston A and this piston B. Now watch when I hit the switch. What? Whoa! As you will notice, piston A will go up first. But it will go down last. Now, if I stand up here and I show you, can you see that? I don't know if you can see that. So when you flick the switch, it gets there last, for first because of this one here. Sorry, and then when it turns off here, the power goes off last here. So um, this is pretty clever the way he laid it out. Now, when I was uh, first got piston mod, I really wanted to make that door, that doorway. That um, I think it was James or wh whoever that was that made it, and so I needed to make a device like this, and I uh, I didn't actually look on bucket forums. I made my own, which is over here, and you may notice it's um, yeah, it, it it's it's much bigger. It does the exact same thing. I um, but th this was my one. I made from scratch without um any help and. Yeah, so, um, but th this is much compact now, so I'm probably going to use this for the doors that I made, which I shall use fly mode because this is my hack, um, hacked one. Uh, these are all my tests. Um, this was my original test, which, um, completely failed. Ready? Fail. Um, anyways, I I'm going to go over here. Oh, and this is another original test. Um,. So yes, uh, if if you can see here, wee yeah. So um, yeah, and then um, I found out that I can actually not interfere with it by using this switch here. If you want, if you want me to make a tutorial on how to make this, I probably will show you. Um, hopefully I'll be able to make it in my uh, let's play if I get enough resources. But anyways, um, if you notice when you hit the switch. It activates my circuit over here, which I originally made. Um, so yeah, that, that's that's how I got it. Also, um, the only thing I copied from the video that I watched for the 1.7 release would be the way I powered the bottom ones, because I originally powered it underneath to hide all the circuitry, but it, I don't know, it glitched it, so it, it wouldn't retract; it would only extend. But anyways, um, I figured out if I put a torch here, and um, I put a redstone block on the top here. As long as it's not moving to anything, it actually powers both at the same time, which is um, quite useful. Makes it more compact, I find. So, yes, um, I'll show you one more quick example. I made this all underground over here. I made it all nice and covered. So, as I show you, boom. See, and it goes down my hallway. Um, yes, so I'm going to go down here and show you. Uh, I I just set this all up. Um, I, I didn't really give a damn watching the video. I just did it my own way. Anyway, so yeah, see, this is that room. That, that That's this room. Uh, with the um, that little circuit in it, which I can now make nice and neat. No, who gives a shit? Yeah, I'm, I'm using a hacks. Who cares? It's a, it's a hacks world. Um, so, anyways, 
uh, that that's quite interesting. I've got other adventures here if you want me uh, to show it to you later. But I'm gonna just go quickly through how to make one of these because people have been asking me. Well, uh, well, they've been asking on the forum, so it's it's, it's pretty simple. You just go one, two, three, four, and you put two torches on one of them, and um, you choose a powder block. Uh, I'll choose this one just to stay true to the diagram that he's laid out, and this is how he's laid it out. So you've got a switch here, powers this block here. Next, you get redstone repeaters. You stand on this block and you make it go away from this block. So we don't want it from this block. Go away. Um, then you go over here and you go, uh, and you just fill in the circle basically. So one of them opposes. Um, but now you can see there's a problem. If I hit the switch, they're pretty much instant. Even though it does the same concept, it's instant. And with pistons, if if it's instant, then if if it's even if it's halfway through retracting, it's the other one still won't take it. So what we need to do is we need to add some delay. I add four on each side. It it basically does the same thing. Um, but what you can do, I believe, I set it out on this one, is the way you did in the diagram on the forums. So this is two, this is two, this is one, this is one. So you, you just have to right click once, right click once, right click twice, and which one haven't I done yet? That one there, right click twice. So, and then that's it. You have made your thing, and then you can just hook this up. Um, I hook this side up here to the part which extends the blocks forwards, making it all secret. And I believe I put this one here to the ones that just move it out and clear the hallway for you. And the one that um, ex extends and makes it all hidden, I normally attach that one to the stairs underneath. But if you want me to make a tutorial on how to make it, uh, I can for you. It's all it's all up to you. But other than that, that's that's pretty simple. Uh, so thanks uh, for watching this short tutorial. New Let's Play should be up very soon, next week sometime. Um, so yeah, I'll see you then. Bye.